Good, we made it. Man, this damn building was absolutely fucked up to the very end. But still, you did good, Rachel. I couldn't have done it without you. The same goes for me. Zack? Yeah? It's the way out. We did it. Now we can finally leave this dump. Zack? What? Once we are outside, you kill me, right? What you ask me that for now? Zack, is that what you want as well? See, my desire to die is unchanged, but... But... If possible, I want you to desire it. I want my death to be desired. Though I long for death, the thought of dying alone suddenly makes me feel so desolate on the inside. The thought of you deeply desiring my death makes me truly happy. Although you did just give me a knife, so I feel like I'm being selfish. I gave you that knife earlier for one reason. So you'd survive long enough for me to kill you. Till then, I never did a single thing for anyone in my life. No way in hell would I ever swear an oath for something I don't desire. You mean it? Damn it, will you give it a rest? How many times do I gotta say? That you hate liars? Come on, what you completing my sentence for? When the time comes, make sure you're ready to show me the face I wanna see. Suck at smiling more than anyone I know. You got it. Ray? What the hell? Sick. <laughs> oh, how dreadfully terrible. What a horrible mess. What a creature, the Alte. Guess who blew up the building? It's just a matter of time until flames engulf the upstairs. You bastard. <laughs> and we hot blooded despite being unarmed. What a pity. You promised to each other we'll go on full fight. Zack. Zack. I'm so sorry. Well, what the hell for? I snap out of it. I made a promise to you that I couldn't keep. Sorry. Cut the bullshit. Did I tell you I hate layers? Hey, stay with me. I'm not gonna let you go. You're trapped. Helpless and powerless. And best of all, Zack, I won't let you kill Rachel. How does it feel, you guys? How does it feel to have your dream crushed? I just love to know. Then, after that, what about we all of ourselves? Shit. Zack. Stop lying. Sorry, for fuck's sake. Don't make me a liar. I can't let you die on me. No, Zack. It's okay. You were always there for me. But it doesn't need to every time. What you saying? <laughs> There's nothing more entertaining than a helpless monster. No. He's no monster, but he's no good either. Zack is human. You're human, 
saying. Which is why. Which is why you need always reward yourself to me. Demon? So what? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You don't seek devotion, Rachel. What have you wanted my all, my everything to you? The food, clothing, toys, even the floor itself was all for you. Yes, I gave you a place to thrive. And now you deny that? I'm sorry, Doctor, but none of that is what I wanted. Crash. Then what did Zack give you that's so special? Just some trashy knife? Oh, was it that ridiculous oath? An oath to ensure your death? Absolutely, Lanacy. Despite the fact I, I tried to spare your life. Doctor, I didn't want to move that way. The truth is, I wanted to be desired in life and desired in death, even for a fleeting moment. I realized that a sack and I made it over to stop to leave this place. That was enough for me. Then at least show me your despair. After all, I just snatched away your oath. Shut up! Oh, be quiet, let me finish. Doctor, you haven't snatched it away. This oath, it was sworn by second eye. An oath can't be stolen by someone else. Uh, even if it's never fulfilled, it doesn't matter since it's ours. This I know. Wait, I just can't accept that. Say, I bear this oath. So please don't think of yourself as a liar. Zack, our promise doesn't have to be fulfilled. Ray, Ray, Ray! <laughs> oh, and Ray too. If you intend to live the rest of your life with those invasive, distrusting peepers, I thought that it would matter that we can live together. Yes, if you would remain in isolation forever, we could die now a happy man. Yet, why do you insist on distancing yourself from isolation to the very last? You ruined it, so it's all over. Your desire and sex, all of it, everything. I put an end to them, along with my own desires too. Da steht er mit der Armbrust. What are you doing? I say, you have taken your indulgence too far. I'm not finished yet. I must take care of them. Uh. Oh, Zack, can you still move? Bastard, say your fucking prayers. Save your strength for leaving this place. Mind your own beast box. A human will die from this much blood loss. What's the point of going outside if she dies? Rachel Gardner is still quite alive. Take her outside now and she will be safe. What do you mean? Find out for yourself. Seriously, is this chick a model or something? The building could collapse at any moment, Zack. Geht der Opa jetzt mit drauf? 
Ah, this place is no more. It is an unexpected end to this tale. Would you not say, Daniel? Reverend, why? I admitted I was selfish, but yes, it was for your sake too. Still, my actions were not a mistake in the place. It was for my happiness and my meddling in matters of those who have set the laws of building should have been a city in some way. Oh, Daniel, it was helpful indeed. I was able to observe something quite fascinating. I originally believed Zack to be a crystalline winged being. Those wings, however, have faded away. Crystalline wings? Did you truly think of him as an angel? Indeed, he was pure hearted, and bloodshed was all he had ever known. Nonetheless, the blade Zack wielded for that very purpose came to serve another. Consequently, his blade was broken. Zack has lost his wing, he is now human. Well, it is better to say he was human all along, perhaps. That is merely just a coincidence. What is more intrusion is that the one who showed me dead was the child I condemned as a witch, Rachel God. Rachel. It was a radical transformation. Quite tell and she was merely a selfish, contradiction riddle girl. An inside, perhaps, was who attempted to protect his humanity. That is true, then why, why did you shoot me? My monitoring and experiment have already run their course. My role as the eyes of God is ended, and this shall serve as my Inconsequential consequential Alright, after all this time, whatever for. Then, you are the one who brought that girl, desiring to bestow souls instead of with them. Do not attempt to become the god of that child. Then, then, you are not a god, and you also knew this, did you not? But what else is there for me then? When I saw Rachel's people, they were in lo unloving and full of such despair. I longed to shower the people with love for all eternity. It was then that my wants in science life gave meaning again. I could accomplish anything to make it come true. But I can no longer love those people. I mean, she isn't alone. Who will love such an ugly wretch like myself? How oh, dare you? By sharing her with love, you would only desire to someday be loved yourself. No, that's not it. Danny, we are merely human. Ah, it seems. Humans were the only beings here from the start. Yet humans create gods, angels, and even humans themselves. In fact, perhaps that was true for Rachel Garden. And those who destroy them are human as well. Oh, Reverend, what is it to have seen with the human seen? Well, regretfully, what I always see light, darkness, and beauty. Nothing more. Oh, and Daniel, I feel the same can also be said for you. I only realize this now, despite the stay here being the longest, forgive me. My time has drawn to an end. Now, you choose to call me beautiful. Indeed. Hey, hang in there. We're almost outside. Don't go die on me now.
Hey, we're outside. Take her out and she will be saved. What did he mean by that? What am I supposed to do now? Hey, wake up. Hey, Ray. Wake up. Are you just gonna die on me? For fuck's sake. Open your eyes. So when that bastard preacher said she'd be safe. This is what you meant, eh? No, no, it's safe. Well, this place did light up like the 4th of July. So that's how it is, huh? Rachel Gardner, a girl who vanished during question regarding the Gardner, Herman said, was found near a burning building in blah 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 blah, blah and taken into protective custody. Found accompanying her was Isaac Foster, a suspect presumed to be involved in a string of murders which have made headlines in past years. This time, Foster was charged and arrested for kidnapping, and though he denies these allegations he has gone on record to admit the murder allegations are partly true. Furthermore, the body of a man was found in the burnt remnants of the building, though authorities have unable to innovate. Ich lese jetzt mal nicht vor.
könnte auch Sack nicht killen. So, Rachel, is there anything you feel uneasy about? No, not really. So you're sleeping well at night, I take it? Yes, I see. Well then, that should be enough for today. My apologies for being late. I had a session with another child at run over time. It's fine. I take you to your room. I can manage by myself. No, no, we can't just let you do that, can we? Sorry, but... Okay. Oh my, what a beautiful moon today. Right, Rachel? Isn't it a lovely night? Lovely night? Yes, on days like this it's best just to hop right into bed. Sweet dreams await you. Okay, let's go. What is it, Rachel? Nothing. I see. Good. Yeah. Rachel, are you scared? Huh? Your condition has improved dramatically during your time here. The person who was with you... That killer, you're no longer obsessed with him like you used to be. Triggered. So I tell you this, just to put you at ease. It's sort of against the rules, but... That killer... Is to be executed. Super trigger. Nein, ich sag. I see. Is that so? Yes, it probably came as quite a shock to you, though now you can sleep with peace of mind tonight. Yes. Well, let's get going then. Now behave yourself and go to sleep, alright? The truth is that my nights were always restless and my mind was unease. The night was supposed to be another sleepless night. Ich habe ein bisschen Angst. All I could do was shut my eyes. That sound, is it coming from the window?
What's that sound? Rachel! It's not someone who works here. Then... Rachel, open up! Ray, Ray, Rachel, what's going on in there? Oh no, I gotta call the police. Get back. Ta-da! Sick? Oh man! Do you go again making that boring face? Sick, how did... Huh? How did I want? I mean, you're supposed to be in prison. Prisons are made to be broken out of, right? But back then, I said I'd bear the outcome of our oath. So what about it? I mean, it's not used to bear anyhow. Thank So, you still want to kill? This is me you're talking to you. I never lose sight of something that I want, right? Hurry up. There ain't much time left. Oh, did you forget? No, say. I'd never forget. Not in a million years. I mean, it's an oath. Elf, you and I swear together. No, that's more like it. Hurry, this way. Come with me, Ray. Okay, okay. Ready? Everyone push together. Hey, Zach. Thank you. 